Hello and welcome back to another episode of the Minecraft Java Rock Survival Series, the series where you play in both versions of Minecraft. Without further ado, let's get started with today's video. Why do I have a gold helmet? You thought I went to the nether? Well, no. You see, I did some a little work off camera. I made this a ladder instead. I also made this other layer. No, it's, no I did not make the zombie farm. I made this. Yeah, I'm gonna... It's not gonna stay like this. I'm gonna put some walls here. Not actual wall blocks, but you know. And yeah, I cooked up potatoes because I was running out of steak. I have the chicken, but I think it should go for a little while. And look, I even got Silk Touch. And I upgraded my sword a little. Same with the bow. And yeah. Today, we're gonna make a automatic wolf farm. Yeah, I like this thing. Alright, we'll work on this another time. But if we want ancient debris, the easiest way to get that is by explosions. So, and the cheapest explosion there is, well, is beds. I actually have a sheep in my house, so, yeah. I said they weren't spawning, but I actually found one over there. Yeah, I also moved the cow pen over here. I just, I just terraformed and made some room for the sheep farm. So forgive me. I also ex extended the fence to that tree. Alright, so here are all the materials I'm going to need other than the sheep. Because, you know, I can't access spawn eggs. If I did have one here, you would know I've been cheating. Which, no, I haven't. Alright. Let's grab our stuff. Well, some of it. We're going to... So... First off, we're gonna actually gonna dig down one. Uh, hang on, how about we? All right, I have an idea. We'll do a double chest and keep this dirt for terraforming. Grab the hopper, make sure it's facing in here, then put a rail, and then this. Oh no, no! All right, how do I? You have to break the rail now. Uh oh. Well then, uh. Yeah, that happens. You gotta really be careful. Like, make sure, like, the hitbox is showing. Alright. Okay. This is gonna be a little hard. I'll be back once I, I do it. Just just dig the rail if you're building this. Okay, I've done it. Now, it doesn't have to be birch planks. It can be a block of choice. Now we actually have to grab one of our stairs. You actually don't need this much glass. I just put it there. So you do this. All around like that. But you have to go another layer up. And you put a stair... Oh, oh. Okay, that chest is gonna get in the way. Stair like that. Alright. Now, you grab this stuff. Put it all on top. But actually, not right here. Actually, yeah. Sorry about that. Make sure it's facing... Nope. Make sure it's facing in the center grass block. Grab your redstone. Glass. Hang on, we gotta get up there now. We actually have to grab our dispenser, put it here, and grab our shears. Now, they will run out of durability eventually, which is why I'm using my shear that I had and two others. Now, we surround this with glass, cover it on top until we get a sheet. 
but I think night is falling, so we're gonna go to sleep first. And now that I have still touch, I think I should move this. Yeah, I don't know. Can I sleep? I can. Alright, now that we don't need these rails anymore, and I think one of them is actually in the ch double chest. Oh dear. Alright, we're gonna need our food back. And also, this thing has over a stack of cooked chicken now, so I'll have infinite chicken. As long as the chickens don't despawn, which they haven't. Alright, so, we have the rails in here. We're gonna have to take that out. Hey, you, you might want to make a staircase for your sheep. Oh, and make sure this is grass. So, we gotta go like this. Make sure he falls in here. That's very important. Now for the redstone. I gotta get rid of this. And now it should work. Allow me to test it. Oh, hang on. What happened? I, I actually don't think I did this right. Only way to find out is to bring your sheep in here. Which, actually, I don't think I saw him in our house. Oh, did he despawn? Oh no, he's right there. Let's grab a piece of wheat. Let's put this in the composter. Let's grab back our wheat. Come back. Come back. Sorry. Alright. Come on, this way, this way. You don't need to be trapped in there for much longer. And by much longer, I mean never again. I have a new cramped up home for you. I'm sure you will love it. Alright, this way. Follow the grass path. Up the slabs. Now, the reason I say I don't think I did this right is because the redstone. I forgot where I'm supposed to put the redstone. Alright, maybe I have to get a little more out. Well, he accidentally ate that. Okay. It's a bad sheep. Oh, you want me to stop with the jokes? Okay, I'll stop. That's right, I can hear you. Alright, I'm just making him go in the circle. Oh, come on. Um, hello. I got your favorite snack. And I need you to... Yeah, I'm... Yes, I'm gonna make a mess. Okay, why do they always just jump off? Yeah, I wish I could put this in my offhand. Because once I build, he just loses interest. <laughs> Alright. Alright. Alright, snail. There we go. Alright, now that we have the sheep in, you can <laughs> dig the mess. Alright, doesn't seem to be working, because he ate the grass. Now, we did get rid of one. Luckily, we have silk touch. Oh, yeah. That was all something else. I just flattened this area out. I don't think you guys wanted to see that. There. Alright, now I have to get this redstone right. 
I'll be back in a jiff. Okay, I think I did it right. Look up there. So you put a you put a block right next to the back of the uh, observer, and then two redstone right across like that. So as soon as that grass grows, okay, he should be sheared. My, okay, I think we should shear him first. All right, let's let's get up there because because he should be sheared before we actually put him in there. All right. Oh wait, I think I did this wrong. What is wrong with me today? Um, I, I did this in a flat world testing it out. And of course now it's not working. Hang on, allow me to fix this whole thing. Well, kind of the whole thing. Aww, looks like we have a visitor. Uh, oof. Bad trades. Well, I could buy sea pickle, but you know, I don't have the emeralds for it. But, uh, can I have, can I buy something for free? Those leads! And I can use that leather. Oh, yes, free leads. No, that's a good trade. Okay, it should work now. Alright, so I have to move the redstone one block below the dispenser like at the like the same level as the the observer and also yeah still put a block there all right and yeah the, i did shoot it manually and shears are uh, i mean wool are still going in the chest but he ate the grass before i could finish so oh wait the grass grew back yep that's why you put grass around it all right it's Night is falling again. Coming. I think that's what it means. <laughs> well, eat, boy. You're sheared, so. Oh, he's eating. It works. Alright, so that's how you build the farm. And already, we're able to make two beds. Oh, yeah. Ancient debris upgrading instantly, at least the armor. By instantly, I mean I haven't wore it yet, so. Yeah, so exactly like this. Sorry, kind of messed up the tutorial a little bit. And I plan on making different color sheep in the future, like maybe this whole area. Alright, I'm like, like that farm, I think it might stay AFK, because next episode, I want to get lots of ancient debris. Like, upgrade all of our diamond gear. And I think I'm gonna get a diamond axe too because, well, while I was off camera, I actually didn't want to lose the durability on this because I want to show you guys like the cool sword, knockback two, and unbreaking two now. Still sharpness four. But yeah, I'm gonna stay FK over there after I sleep. And yeah, maybe I'll try to find a looting three book too. I know that's kind of random, but I want to take on the nether fortress again. Trying to find some wither skulls. And looting three is our best option. If you guys did enjoy today's episode of the series, don't forget to leave a like and also make sure you subscribe and turn on post notifications so you never miss an upload. If you want to see me fighting in the breeze, then that's a good reason to turn on notifications. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye.